Whoa, going downhill holding the camera. <laughs> folks Sean here from biking with Sean on YouTube and today I'm gonna go bike riding if you can believe that <laughs> so I'm gonna go to Giant City um, I go to Giant City a lot uh, I went into more detail in a previous video on why I go to Giant City so much um, I'll throw a link up there somewhere. You can go check it out and uh, watch it, and it'll kind of tell you. But also because it's close. Uh, today's topic of the video is going to be how YouTube has helped save my life. Yeah, that's right. YouTube has helped to save my life. Um, but first, I do believe there there is a very big need for a wardrobe change because as much as I like my Hiking with Sean t-shirt, I don't want to be biking in jeans and uh, steel toe boots. So definitely need to change into some more comfortable, soft, cycling attire. So we'll do that in three, two, one, Alrighty, much better. Much better. Cycling attire on. It's definitely a no sleeve day today. Um, it's pretty hot. Um, I'm actually parked right now and the engine's not running, so I'm sweating uh, to, to do that little trick shot. So YouTube, YouTube kind of helped save my life. What I mean by that is because of how popular my hiking channel has become and how popular my biking channel is starting to grow really well. Whew. So YouTube, YouTube more or less helped save my life. And earlier, as I was saying, when I first started YouTube, um, I uh, just did it for fun. Just like something fun to show off my hikes. I figured like five, 10, maybe 20 at the most would uh, subscribe. And within a year, there's over 600, now I'm nearing a thousand. But cutting all that out, um, because of the subscriber rate, as well as the uh, the amount of support I got from the channel, it motivated me to focus a lot of energy on the channel, buy new equipment, buy better cameras, uh, buy a whole new laptop just for my YouTube, um, shooting 4K, all that stuff. It inspired me to get better at it. And because of that, I always wanted to get new footage and uh, <clears throat> because I always wanted to get new footage I uh, I'm constantly hiking so I've lost a ton of weight I make better health decisions now because I want to be good at hiking and uh, you know I'm, I'm I feel healthier now than I did when I was in my early 20s and, and late teens um, I feel really healthy and now that I'm hiking again and enjoying it um, I'm starting to get back into biking and that's kind of why I made the second channel biking with Sean so I can focus all of the effort of this channel on cycling and hopefully it'll encourage me to get out more and ride more bikes 
or you know ride the bike more Whew, it's hot <clears throat> and right now it's in the 90s and I'm out riding so I'm encouraged <laughs> Look at that beautiful sight. YouTube, uh, YouTube has saved my life because I get out more, constantly want to ride, constantly want to hike, and constantly want to improve. And the only way to do that is to get out. Um, is to do what... And some people have YouTube video or channels that are not really fitness related. And maybe they can't exactly compare their situation to mine. But what I do is all active. Something is clicking on my bike. I don't know what. Anyway, everything I do is active, hiking and biking. So, I'm getting out more and uh, getting more video. And because of that, it's making me a healthier person. And now with this biking thing, I'm gonna want to get all the video I can. So, right now I have a perfect setup. Bike through the week and hike on the weekends with a little bit of biking too and that way I can balance out both channels and balance out my activities and keep enjoying it nine miles 42 minutes 48 seconds finish Mountain bike road ride. Period. Giant city state park. Period. So this isn't sponsored, but these are my bibs, bib shorts. And uh, you can kind of see it's like a camouflage pattern, but it's camo bikes instead of like that well there's a few like well no they're written it's all bikes so you got like the brown the tan the black with the camo green in the back so i thought that's a really cool short bib short to get really super comfortable um here's what the little liner or the little straps on the leg look like there's that little bit of silicone or whatever it is and mainly compression holding it up and they don't ride up the pad is really comfortable, and you can get it at aerotechdesigns.com. It's made in the U.S. Great company. Um, my jersey is even from Aerotech. It's just a standard yellow jersey that you could zip halfway down. I don't like the full zip ones because the sometimes the zippers mess up, and it's hard to zip them back up. This jersey uh, used to be pretty tight-fitting on me. I've lost a lot of weight, so soon I'm gonna have to get uh, some tighter fitting jerseys to kind of pat myself on the back for staying healthy and losing weight. So, I'm done with my ride, bike's in the back of the truck, taking a breather, um, and just continuing my talk about YouTube. So, YouTube, has really done a lot for me health-wise, like I, I was saying earlier, where it's uh, made, a, made a difference in me getting out and being active. But it also it impacts my health in other, other ways. So for example, um, I find this to be such, such a good hobby and passion that I never wanna go out and drink, like at bars or, or bonfires or anything like that i'd rather be out here doing this and that's healthy i drink a little bit here and there but i don't get drunk anymore um also from the stress in life you know being a former college student with student loans and general debt and you know 
problems at home, problems at work, just the normal everyday stress that causes a lot of people depression. I don't get it. I don't get depressed because when I hike and I bike, it just enhances my mood. It's like a drug. Hiking and biking to me is like a drug. I get a natural high from it all. And it's a healthy one. Um, I've said that many times. And uh, yeah, so I don't really get depressed. And, and hiking and biking, once you get over the initial setup, it's free after that. Bike wherever you want, free. Hike wherever you want, free. Most, most of the time. Chances are you can find somewhere to hike and bike for free. YouTube has done a lot for me. And I want to thank each and every one of you who are watching that helps, uh, cause you're a big help. You motivate it. You motivate me to continue doing YouTube, continue getting better at it and continue pumping out these videos. So you all, each and every one of you who watch me, whether it's on this channel or my hiking with Sean channel, you're all responsible for my good health. So thank you. And you know, that really means a lot to me and I really mean thank you. So, uh, you know, y'all helped change my life for the better. But I'm thinking about going on a little hike. Highly thinking about, but it's really super hot and I'm not going to put on jeans. So it's going to be bike shorts, <laughs> but I'm going to check my stats for the ride. Cause it felt like some of them times I went really, really fast. So let's see here. We have, we have, oh, nine miles total, 511 foot elevation gain, 42 minutes and 41 seconds. Max elevation was 758 feet. Mm, max speed 27.7 average 12.7 not bad on a mountain bike uh, and other stuff is premium that I really don't care about but I got some like trophies I thought it said some sort of like trophy thing on there huh whatever I guess I'll share it share it to some Facebook. So thanks for watching. Until next time, come ride with me.